To recap really quickly, we created an event to be pushed from TypeBot to be pushed over to the data layer with this code snippet. And once we do that, we are creating a trigger called custom event generate lead. We're going to use this trigger to then send event data over to Google Analytics 4 and Universal Analytics. This way we can record conversions. I'll show you how to do that with Universal Analytics first. Make sure you have your workspace selected. I have my cabinpromos.com workspace here. I'm gonna head over to tags. And then from here, we're going to create a new tag. To keep my sanity, I'm gonna call this UA custom event and then the name of the event. Then head over to tag configuration. From here, we'll select universal analytics and the track type will be event. Now I want this event to match the conversion or the goal that I set up. So let's head over to Google Analytics. Make sure that you are in your universal analytics instance. Here I am. And then go to admin, head over to goals, select your goal. And under goal details, you'll see the category action and label names you need to pass in. In my case, I'm only requiring for form and submit to be passed in as event conditions. So I'll pass in the same information over here in our tag. Once I enter the category and action name, I'll go down here and select the tracking ID. So here's my universal analytics ID. I'll select that. And then I want to trigger this on the custom event that we just created a moment ago. You can find this in a previous video. Select your trigger, click on save, and now let's preview our changes. Click on continue. To start, we can see which tags were actually fired. As expected, we have our universal analytics base tag. Now we're trying to fire this custom event. To do that, I'm going to initiate our chatbot, head over to the tab here and move this tag assistant prompt I'm going to start the chatbot. I'm going to go back to Tag Assistant. And here we can see that our generate lead event got triggered. Also, we can see that this Universal Analytics custom event was also triggered. Now let's head over to Google Analytics. Make sure that your Universal Analytics instance is selected. Head over to Real Time under Events. And here you can see the event that got fired. And remember, we set up our conversion or the goal to have this event category and this event action name. Let's go back to Google Tag Manager and submit our changes. Click on Submit. And enter your version description. And then click on Publish. All right, in the next video, I'll show you how to do the same process, but send that event data over to Google Analytics 4.